that lady had some money. I do think so. Yeah, she had. She, they said that she had like three lockers here, and she was worth a million dollars, and she died, and nobody would come and claim this stuff. You hear something? Those are gold. This is heavy. This is heavy. Oh, yes! Yes! Doing Robert Zaba Auctioneer Extraordinaire with just Jeff and I bought this unit for $320. And if you guys don't know anything about U Haul, sometimes they only take one picture, right, just Jeff? Yep. One picture. So you got to figure out what's inside there from the one picture. So let's take a look inside. If you haven't subscribed, hit that bell. Get on the notification subscribe. And this is kind so, of what I saw. So, like, right about like that. It's about the Can one. Look at the screen. Maybe a little bit more here. This angle? About here, yeah. Hmm. Okay. So uh, that doesn't see, tell me there's much. There's definitely art, and that's one of the reasons. Oh dear! <laughs> Holy smoke! Oh wow! <laughs> well, I was not expecting that. Was that was in the picture. I did not see that. What the heck is it? I think this is for like hunting, maybe like a uh, practice there, maybe. I don't know. Oh, you could for target practice. It's possible, and that's pretty realistic. Bring it out, man! It's got to come out. Bring oh, it out. Oh dear! Wasn't expecting to find that. <laughs> I feel like Santa Claus. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty got, realistic, doesn't it? Grandma got run over by a reindeer. Does that look realistic or is it just me? Well, guess what? It's missing the bottom of its legs. Right. I bet you they're in there. Maybe. If they're in there, that's crazy, man. What would you say you paid for this? $320. On one picture. And no one deer. So, it's very dark in there. I think that I should just... You should bring it yeah, out to I'm me. I'm gonna bring it out. It's definitely very dark in here, and that was one of the things I took a gamble of risk because I seen all this and this one piece right here. I was like, well, this could be about the artist on the back. Could not. Let's take a look at the first piece. Oh, look at that. Signed, numbered. So there's something on the back. There it is. That's about the artist. So now the question is, is it all different types of art? But gotta be. I took a gamble, I took a risk, you know, and then I found a deer. So mm -hmm. I can't I don't know if you can go wrong with that. The deer is awesome. Oh man. The Made in the Mist Flam Norway. Huh. Did they have that? Can we possibly just take one minute and just line these up down the wall? All of them? I think so. That's a lot of Right well, you you going through each one of those? Maybe. I don't know. I'm just trying to see what kind. Of, I'm trying to get a feel for what we got here. All I'm, all I'm, all I'm saying is, I want to play with some bubble wrap. 1953 Supreme Court of United States. What? It looks pretty, like official in the court. It's from the Supreme Court. What is this? If you buy this kind of stuff, you never know if it's just all going to be old photos or you're taking a gamble and a risk. That's kind of cool. 1934. You're going to find some cool stuff in here, huh? They took the time to wrap it all. Let's take a box down. I don't know what this is. A giant hanky set? Nope. Crochet. Napkin. Right, crochet? Very pretty. I can't do it. I don't have the patience for it. Very interesting so far. 12517. That's been a minute. So all this stuff's been in here for seven years. Well, let's not say all. Huh. Teddy bears. Oh, this could be good. Is this a stife? No. It's not it's Shanghai, Shanghai Dao Factory. It looks like a stuff, doesn't it? Stuff will have the thing in the ear. Well, not all the time, because sometimes they come out just, Jeff. Bad kids, you know? You ever had any bad kids? Oh, you got good kids, luckily. No, my kids all turned out pretty Paddington good. Paddington Bear. 
They were better than you. That's all that matters, right? Yeah, apparently, I'm the bad one in my group. <laughs> it's okay, me too. Look at this one. Teddy bear collection. Is this another Paddington bear? I know these are going to be worth some money. Please look after this bear. Thank you. What do you think, Just Jeff? I think now you've been given a responsibility to, to somebody to look after the bear. Paddington? You've taken it on. You've taken it on. Interesting. Oh, there's a bunch of boxes of bacon. And then there's like something that's under and maybe a piece big of furniture. Like totes. Interesting. Very interesting. Oh, that's old. That's a picture of somebody's history. Yeah. And this looks like Alfred Hitchcock. Oh, it looks, says something on the bottom. That looks like you in 10 years. Woo. J. Robert Wilson, Chairman, presenting our appreciation ATA Industry, Industrial Relations Committee. That means they can have some good money stuff yeah. in here. Oh, here's a whole thing. Benefactors? Did we just buy a millionaire dude? After years of struggling to get along with one hearing ear, Virginia Wilson learned how to do it with four. Ms. Wilson's hearing problem began in the 30s. Not only Dr. Sharon Wilson, a professor of clinical disorder, I'm trying to read all this. It's hard for me to get an angle on that. <laughs> I'm not sure. But that looks like the guy. It's getting more and more interesting. It is. Go. So we got some clothes. A little box right here. Slides. Can't show that on TV. No, I'm just joking. <laughs> Peters, Petersburg. St. Petersburg, I'm not sure. So we got all kinds of slides, and believe it or not, people buy these. This is just clothes in here. Look at this. Interesting. So it looks like pretty fancy clothes to me. Once again, I know nothing about clothing. Jeff's our clothing aficionado, and he knows nothing about clothing. Oh, I know. The you? Well, I know storage locker clothing. I'm going to a wedding reception this weekend, uh -huh. and I, I need an outfit, so. You got one on now? No, I'm, I'm eyeing up them shirts. Hey, Joe. Jeff, I'm going to give you the bird. I like that. He's cool. Can I borrow him? The bird? Yeah. Birds to work. We're having a luau type party, and I, mean, I think that would that fit idea? the luau. Was that you? Was it? He said, I need to do a theme party. Uh, so I should do a luau. Oh, that's a good well, idea. Those are my boxes. Just waiting for hit something crazy in here. Virginia's bed and breakfast. What the heck is this? This looks cool. It's like holding history in your hand. Okay. You got postcards, letters, pamphlets, Volcano House, Hawaii National Park. And people out there, I mean, obviously, a lot of people gone to Hawaii for honeymoons and all that. 365 bucks for two weeks, Jeff. Let's do it. I was married on the island of Hawaii. That's enough about Jeff. <laughs> there were actually wild roosters running around. We're married in the Fern Garado. And there's Jeff and his wife. Wait, that's not you. Sorry. Pretty cool, though. Thanks. It was okay. You want this album oh, to put yeah. your photos in there? No, I got one. That's cool? But there's some cool stuff. I got my own. That's all I'm saying. More photos. 1970s. There's a box down here. Pictures? Yep. Hope and money. But if you got your photos in here, you could have any uh, personal stuff in here, right, Just Jeff? Yep. That's one thing I like about finding photos in units because few of your most cherished possessions behind these are candles. And you more likely could leave your most cherished, valuable possessions behind. What's this? 
I don't know. Did, did you get any information out of them, like who owned this? No. This, I got the, I got the vibe of a, a deceased here. You yeah, know? me too. I would definitely say it's someone that's deceased. And everything we're finding here is definitely old. Well, hand painted that. Someone might have been an artist, inspiring artist. I would say another hand painted one. Those don't have much value. No. One thing I learned about this world, there's a lot of artists. And not a lot of art is worth money. And that art is not worth money. I don't think you said that right. I just said that right? Yeah. Okay. I, don't, I don't think there's a lot of there's a lot of artists out there that don't get paid what their art is worth. That's that's saying the same thing a little nicer. Art is in the eye of the beholder. Yeah. For me, I don't think this is that cool, but Jeff loves fruit baskets. <laughs> How did you know? There you go. Like I said, I bought it, bought it to take a chance on all this. What do I have? Cat stuff? More photos. More photos. I say all photo boxes. It says pictures. Uh oh. <laughs> Hold on, Jeff. Hold on. I see some earrings right here. Those are old screw back earrings. Those aren't clip ons. Okay. Uh oh. I see a pin right here. Two pins. And these are a lot of times can be gold. Let's look at these. There are so there's a mark on that one right there. So we got earrings, pins. Oh, this just looks old. Calendar 1964. Oh, that's a great year. Let me guess, you're born. Akron Dime Bank. Look at this old key. It's got a smiley face on there. It's got a little truck there. There's a pen. and shells all over the place. American Airlines, 1970. That's crazy. There's all these shells down here. Aloha, Hawaii. Oh, right there. Mizuki. Oh, that's a cool one. Yeah, that's a cool one. Yeah, Zuki before? No. At the zoo, but, they used to go around, you push this in, and they would tell a story at different locations. They actually oh, brought really? the zoo key back last year or two years ago. Go ahead, oh, Jeff, your story. I'm getting a feeling now. Is there a potential that this may be like a, a airline worker with all the traveling? I don't know about a worker. I'm thinking that maybe they uh, just traveled. Just wealthy and traveled. No, I think they work for a business. They traveled all the time in airlines. Okay. Same goal, though. Got these little trinkets you gotta look at. A lot of times they're at least gold filled. This box, who knows what's down here. So I want to say world traveler, but we haven't seen anything representing around the world, right? Hawaii is the furthest we've seen. Uh, looks like German. I'm telling you, I'm on to something. Jeff, you are on something. I'm, I'm a flipping detective. 1994, 1971. What were those? Were those bombs? Just the calendar, baby planner. And the small brown envelopes? Small brown envelopes, I love Viking Import House, Importers, Dayton, Ohio. In sword. Huh? What? A lot sticking it now. Importer, exporter, world traveler. Scottish Terrier Club. They're in the Scottish Terrier Club, importing and exporting. Oh, no. Do you remember what you want to know? Paperwork. There's going to be something in here. You're going to, you're going to do it. I'm hoping. A triple wow. This says pictures. That's not exciting. Oh, my gosh. Does this say 114.19? Yep. When I open it up, I can see old pictures on top.
We've got all this history right here. That's old. Yep. 1910s, 20s. There's a letter in here. 1946. International Toronto. So the question is, were they a traveler like pre-50s or after the 50s? Well, or is this two generations here? It could be three. We're just scratching the surface yeah. in our archaeology the, the here. The plot just thickens. More 1944. Definitely lots of paperwork. That's one of the things I like about this. It almost is like investigation work. It is investigation. This says keep mom's I mean, papers. You don't have to investigate, but... <laughs> Nineteen sixty three. Tons of letters in here. Sixty three. Akron City. So you think if their kids put the stuff in the unit, why wouldn't they keep the pictures and stuff, you know? When you say pictures you mean the family pictures, not the artwork. Right? That's the family photos. What the heck is in here? Gosh. Is that old travel stuff? Looks like old trail brochures. Here's postcards. Your underwear. <laughs> Slightly stained. Just that's enough. We don't need none. I thought you wanted these. Oh, there's more down here. I'm for glad you. you delete that. Christmas stuff. Looks like kid stuff. You should have put the skivvies straight back in the garbage bin instead of... Those are for you. I'm saving them. Yeah. Huh. Some kind of ski resort or something. Heart of the Swiss Alps. International travelers, just Jeff. Maybe a spy. Working for the United States government. Royal ambassador. Do you... I don't know if this is, we should even talk about this, but do you know anyone in your personal life that like has come from a ton of money and you've seen where the family's gone down to kind of nothing? I've, I've seen a couple of families growing up like that. They blew up all their money? Yeah, just different things that happened and they, they, yeah. they pretty much, you know, bad investments and, and had too much fun, spent money and didn't make the money. Because at some point there's a ton of money here involved with these people. And it ended up in a storage unit. Sad. Sign looks like an original. Right there. Watercolor, I love you. Artist name. Burrito, Ohio. Telephone number, 85 bucks. Back before they even had area codes. <laughs> this looks nice. People Watchers, Serograph by Robert Alexander, Talmadge, $35 frame. That's neat. That would go next to my mantle in my backyard. That would. Speaking of which, how's that going? <laughs> you figure she'll forget about it? I haven't posted it for sale yet. I noticed. I've been busy. Sign. Watercolor. Nice. Professional artist. It is very helpful when they give the uh, artist some artist information. So one of these pictures is worth $500, $5, $5,000. Who knows? But they're stacked. They're packed. We didn't get to the big ones yet, just yet. There's just so many. I'm saying if you said ten bucks a piece, and Jeff went in line with the whole hall. We have the whole hall lined up. And I'm still, telling you, we should do that. This is a regular picture. That's pretty cool. Art stuff always sells, especially horses. People love horses. And you don't get rid of it. No. You it's have. True. You have All right. rooms full Giant of artwork. Box.
Right? Oh. I see kitchen. There's no kitchen here. It's a KIT Shot on the side. Eh? Brand new. My scene. It's a KIT. Maybe that's the person's name, Kit. Or Kit, or it could have been Kitchen stuff. I was wrong, I apologize. You need to calm it down. I don't want to get one. Oh. Sorry. Look at Andrew. Okay, we'll give you no, I'm not sorry. Oh, what is this? There's all kind of stuff out there. Alright, just Jeff. Something good? Razors. Clippers. You want to do your hair? No. Sometimes it's hard to listen to you when I'm following the bouncing ball over here. I'm gonna have to stay in the same spot the whole time. <laughs> you lie it's place. it's the stuff in your in your hands I'm following. Nice case. Your suitcase? It's on. A few things that when I was going through, we missed. We missed them. That's pretty awesome. Hand card. Costa Rica, here. There's another one. Two pie. Two can. Pretty cool. About three of those, they'll be worth like 20, 30 bucks a piece, maybe more. Easy. And then this. Sandy Knickerbocker toy. Original tag still on there. I would never know if the tag was on there. I didn't know that was Sandy. Did you know that was Sandy? I don't know what Sandy is. Little orphan Annie's dog. She had a dog? She was an orphan. That dog looks expensive. Yeah. Did you ever see the movie? <laughs> I, don't, no. I don't think I have. Jeez. Apparently not. Back wall. Oh, man. Looks like we got more old-time old photos here. Nice. Diploma. Nineteen seventy. The whole history here, just Jeff. Yes. So did you get good stuff out of that one? Not yet. Now you. <laughs> We're waiting. I was gonna bid on that, and I thought, nah. It's been interesting for sure. Why would you buy? I didn't buy any of them. I'm, oh. I'm part of the clean-out crew. Oh. These pictures is what I thought was... Yeah, there's some artwork for sure. Yeah. And there's some old stuff, but we still got a lot of stuff to go through. Well, they told me when I called in, they said, oh, you got the art stuff. I said, no, I don't. That was sold. I said, what well, didn't sell was the furniture, and that's what I'm here to clean out. And they were like, oh. Well, the pictures got messed up. Ah. Uh -huh. So, <laughs> they were going to give me that locker to clean out. I thought, no, 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 no. No, I would have been here like, what's going on? It's my... It would not have been the first time something bad happened to me. Well, no. When it comes down to the U-Haul people, they're, they're nice and I don't have an issue with it. All of them good. I've never had a problem with U-Haul. I always like them. It looks old. That's really old. And old frame. And the frame looks pretty... Yeah. Jeff's cousin. Could be. You don't know. <laughs> I'm pretty sure not. And some more not that good art. What is this? Ooh. That looks nice. Peggy Page. Cut man. You like that? Yeah. The butterfly. And if I... you look here, you can see... It's an engraving. See how it's been pressed in here? Right. Yeah. Old engraving. You don't like it? I don't think it really does much for me. I had the beholder, man. I had the beholder. Oh. Damn, looks like you. I guess that lady had some money. I do think so. Yeah, she had. She, they said that she had like three lockers here. And she was worth a million dollars, and she died, and nobody would come and claim this stuff. Oh, and they man. had access to it. 
And were the other two, well, what's the other two units I wonder? I missed those, huh? This was one. It's just all furniture, huh? Yeah. Blankets just, Jeff. That makes sense. Yeah, this was nice. That is something that you would keep for the bedroom. Oh, it's a coat. Oh, yeah. That is. I didn't know it was a coat. Yeah. I thought it was one of those rugs, you know. Yeah. So let's 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 just assume that this person was smaller than you. You think so? I'm, I'm shooting a guess there. Oh, it's a nice coat, though. Or, think for or someone that's someone smaller might through here. It's just a gender book. There's a bunch of agenda books, paperwork, tax stuff. Cash receipt. It's worth a million dollars. Hopefully she put just a little yeah. bit of that money in here. You're not making that stuff up. You heard it from that guy. The source. And he knows. The source. You call that one? It's got Picasso written all over it. Uh, I don't think so. No? He only puts his name in one spot. I don't get it. He says it's written all over it. Oh. <laughs> no, that one went right over my head. It's okay. Even with that, I, I totally even with that hat on, it went over your head. I'm trying to be serious today. I should have caught that. <laughs> that hat was meant to catch those kind of things. That's my new marketing for my band I'm rodeoing for. I'm realizing I'm going to have to hustle while I'm rodeoing to make money. What's that? Cure Bears down there. Oh, no way. Oh, they could be good. Original box. Care Bear. That's probably worth some money. 1984. Yeah. A little dirty. Oh. But it's still in the original box. This one looks dirtier though. Chair Bear. Everyone loves Chair Bear. Was that your favorite Care Bear? Are you making that up or are you for real? You don't think I, I know my Care Bears? I don't know either way. You, you could be lying to me, I wouldn't know. See the rainbow on the chest? Let's you just said bag. everyone loves Chair Bear. Look, I'm just look at the bag. verifying that. Rainbow? And they're probably worth about Chill 100 bear. bucks a piece. 100 bucks a piece? Yeah. Lamps back here. This is a millionaire's lamps, just Jeff. What's this saying? The tags? Red tags just usually are good. Nothing. Oh, that means keep. More artwork here. Oh, ho, ho. no way. Yes. Here we go. This is gonna be worth some money. Well, that's pretty neat. Lion King. Edition size only five thousand. Just Jeff. This is called the Cyril. The Cyr Cyricel. Hmm. Huh. Didn't you just say that we're a kuma batata? Yeah, that was it. How do you say that? Kuma batata. That's a wonderful thing. So I don't know what this is worth, but that's one of the most popular Disney yeah. movies of all time. Go closely amid the noise and haste and remember what peace there may be in silence. As far as possible without surrender, be on good terms with all persons. Speak your truth quietly and clearly and listen to others even the dull and ignorant they too have their story avoid loud aggression <laughs> but once here jeff, jeff see this part here well peace there may be in silence that's funny i get a lot of, i get a lot of grief over talking too much saint paul's church lately. dated 16 something Pretty see cool. that's that's I was lost on the name. What was the title? I don't know. Made me think of Seinfeld. Oh, this is mine. Panther. That's awesome. Or Snow Leopard, I guess. 1975, it says down there. I think, right? Bur Burley. Country Squire Gallery. Yeah. Oh, this is a big diesel. Let's see what we got here, just Jeff. What'd you call it? Big beastly one. Oh. I thought you said big diesel. I'm like, that's a new one. What I think? 
<laughs> what the heck? Is that like carpet? I think it's a giant teddy bear. I'm gonna have to put that in the cool factor. So this is worth more than uh, worth more or less. Gosh, I don't know. Any one of those three, I would I would put on the same level. Wow. This one. You're looking upside down, just Jeff. Well, I'm looking at. Is it damaged? No. Because I don't like those damage. No, it's this one. <laughs> Wait, it's a swan. Turn it over. One more. Yeah, that's a. Well, it's an evil swan. So, serpent swan of your nightmare. <laughs> it's an upset swan. Alright, this is a picture of him and her. Looks like more art. I kinda, are you going to let me look at the picture of him and her later? Yes. No. I would like to see that. This one's in a box. That would help piece a lot of this puzzle together. Ooh, have you have anyone hired anyone to paint yourself? Winter magic, no, but I need someone to. My father did. I don't think I'll ever be at that point. Raccoon. We got a raccoon starting to come around our bird feeders. <laughs> that could get ugly. A bird. Another home painting. What if this lady ends up being a famous artist? And their home paintings, and she's famous. You know, they say they're more famous, they're worth more after they pass on. That's very true. Looks like someone, he said the family didn't want to go through this stuff, but I disagree. To me, it looks like family did go through this stuff. They just didn't take on the pictures, and they just looked for anything that was worth a lot of money, like jewelry. But hopefully I'm wrong. It would be family or staff. They turned it over. U-Haul owns it. They can do whatever they want. No, it, was, it was sold as a lean. Oh, was it? Oh, hold on a second. Oh, I was hoping we had something good in there. Looks like paperwork. Those things. Wood maps. Chalk. Yeah. Photos, pens, oil colors. So here's all their painting stuff. Their art stuff. What the heck? Pictures. Pictures. Can't notice them. Postcards. This thing's loaded. Postcards and they actually do have value. There's some older ones. You know, I told you it's like investigation work. Yeah. I'm really now getting the vibe that somebody's gone through this. <laughs> you know, do you remember buying that locker in U-Haul in Youngstown? You showed up and like the three valuable items that you won in the auction weren't there. Right. And then you showed them the pictures, and then they gave you your money back and wouldn't do anything else. Maybe that's why they only take one picture. Um, just saying. That guy seemed to know a little bit too much. Maybe he went through there? I'm not, my my, my right. suspicion alert is going on. No, but he knows the shenanigans are going on. That was gave him the unit. The only coach in the unit. And look at them, they are pristine. This says sewing, room, picks, and material. It's not like a hard case right there. Oh, that's nice. What are those? It's to hold your pastel. It's a little oh. thin. That's going to be worth a few bucks. $41 price tag on it. Hmm. Photos, patterns. It's got to be collectibles. It's got to be collectibles. <laughs> oh. 
scrapbook. Old scrapbook. 1937. Wow. 36. Not tons of stuff in it, but definitely some scrapping. Old picture frame with that guy. Actually. Okay. Picture, family photos. Do you think the kids would take this stuff? Do you think? It's an American notebook. It's old, 1928. All right, all personal stuff. We'll have to go through them. Could have some good artwork in there. Here's a tote. 20, 30 bucks? On wheels. Easy. Pictures? Oh, no. This has five totes. So where's other totes? So we have artwork, more artwork, all these, look at all these, pictures, 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 Cleveland Law School, there was a teddy bear, all this stuff, so we have to go through, personal, artwork, but either way, Giant tote. That's great. Grandma's. Grandma serving plates. Keep material. So this box, I don't know. Looks like it's been reused. Some of great grandma stuff. Old photos. Old pictures. Hmm. That one says 09 on the bottom. Is that like 1909? Nope, 2009, Jeff. Looks like, I think we had, we had color by then. No. Really? Virginia Wilson. Huh. Interesting. 1959. Yeah, I do really like, like, the history part of this stuff. There's a lot of photos. World travelers. Let's see some of these. A lot of people it's made in Italy. There's a name on there. So some of these handkerchiefs like this can be worth big money. I think the most I ever sold one for is uh, maybe seventy-seven dollars or something. So those are things you gotta look out for. It's kind of a cool pillow. <clears throat> What's it smell like? Yeah. <laughs> Jeff. So like this one, a mirror made in Japan. There's a bunch of old fabric stuff in here. Interesting. This is old paper. Ooh, look at that. An original from Disneyland. Yeah. Magazines. I've seen that before. That's awesome. Is it? Did you date that? I'm assuming there's a date. Apparently, in that corner over there, right here. You're gonna have to read it. Oh, I see it. No. Nope. Copyright, 1964. That's a great year. It's like brand new. Wow. Now can I fold the bag correctly? All right. Put a value on that. Let's play the guess the price game. Um, nine frame like this, probably fifty bucks. Dang it! That's exactly what I was gonna say. Right, I'll let you go first, then. I'm gonna say over fifty. I like it. Oh. Oh. What's this? No way. That's from Fantasia. 
This artwork has been authentically reproduced from the selected originals used by Walt Disney Productions. That's pretty neat. That could be another fifty hundred dollars. I gotta say the map's gotta be worth more. I could be wrong though. Disneyland. 65 Technicolor Celebration. <laughs> you can still get that done today. Always hidden surprises. And that's why we gotta go through everything. That's when the Challenger blew up. Wow. 1986. It's like I'm going back through time, man. Going back through time, and that's what it is. And what's down here, just Jeff? Like whatever it is preserved well. That's a brand new Land's End extra large woman's golden dust sweater. Land's End's not cheap. Oh, what's that? Is that rain? I hope not. It can't be rain. Sounds like rain. Brand new clothes. Clothes. You can always find jewelry. That's a lot of rain. What's in here? Eucalyptus. Crown Royal bag. Nope, it's a silver bag. The jeweler, the web jeweler company. There's the jeweler we just Jeff. Yeah. Ziploc bags. You hear something? Those are gold. Yeah, 14 or 18 carat. Right there. 14 carat, I think. It actually got a nice stone on it, too. If you look at the stone, whatever that green is, can you tell what that is? It's an emerald. It is no, green, it's isn't not, it? Yeah, it's like an iridescent. Oh, man. Give those to the wife. Now, we gotta get down and dirty just real. Okay, I'll be right back. <laughs> I'm gonna see what it looks like. Oh yeah, it's coming down. I think that tote needs washed anyways. Oh, it's hotter. And brand new clothes. Here's a bag right here. That one they had that stuff in it. Is that a cummerbund? Yeah, that's a cummerbund. Right here, see? Nothing in there. U.S. team partner. Got any more jewelry in here? Oh, this is heavy. This is heavy. What is in here? Woohoo! Oh, yes! Yes! Oh, yeah, baby. That's what we're talking about. Gotta find something to get in a million there's unit. Money's always easy to sell. Oh, that looks like mostly silver, huh? I think that's all silver coins, dude. Oh, wow. There you go. There's your payday. Look at all these old coins in there. It's all silver. See, they look like they're all silver coins. Oh, yeah. That's bag number one. I see this. Philippines, one peso, payable to the bearer on demand in silver pesos or legal tender. Currency of the United States, equivalent value. This is a victory one. Look at it. Wow. It's 
gotta be worth some money. No clue what that's worth. In fact, it would be worth two bucks or fifty. This looks like all foreign coins. They don't look silver though. Yeah. 1972 half tower. More foreign coins. Just in foreign coin, foreign money, we got cash, we got silver coins. Now what's inside the bag, just Jeff? Inside what bag? This oh, bag. I... And yet there's more. I'm seeing silver. Oh, and silver bills. Coins. Bills. Foreign. That looks like Russian. Yep, CCCP. This is Soviet Union money. Lenin on the back. There's all kind of old money in here. And there's definitely silver pieces, non-silver pieces. This definitely had some kind of nice piece of jewelry in it. We found coins, we found gold. We gotta go through those bucks. There might be some other treasure still in here, just Jeff. I think it was just full of money. We got millionaires, you know anything's possible, right? Yep. Ooh, here's a box. Ah. Oh. Supposed to have a watch in there. The watch still could be in here. This head. We found lots of little Wait a minute, is that a whip there? I didn't expect to see a whip. I don't think that's a whip. Stop it. Like that. Like that. Close. Oh, it's a purse. Purse. With a whip. Could be a high-end purse, though. Oh. Feels like something's in there. Wallet. Yanni Binny? Sounds expensive. Yanni Binny. Sounds Italian. Expensive. Bear Bradley. It's brand new, never used. Can, they could at least put some money in it to get luck. I think. That ended, that ended up being a $500 box. Uh, I would say a little low, but yeah. You think there's more there than that? $500. In silver? I forget about the 14 karat gold earrings. Oh. <laughs> What's this? $60 price tag on it. It's in a language that I can't read. It's watercolor block. $14.92. That's pretty old, I'd say. So I'm assuming this is special paper for like doing watercolor or something. Probably, probably costs some money. You got frames. Unicorn block print. Everyone loves unicorns. Yeah. Tell them, Jeff. Well, I'm going to say most. They don't do a whole lot for me. You love unicorns. I'm pretty sure they're fake. There's tons of blank canvas. Kind of like Jeff's life. A blank canvas. It is. Every day is a blank canvas for me. What's going to happen tomorrow? Sign. Number peach sorbet. This looks like a... Looks like a masterpiece to me, man. Did you paint this? That is that beautiful. That is beautiful. I'm going to say, if you're going to express yourself, express yourself. Bath Hills Boulevard, 96. See? That's an expression. Yeah. That's just like... This is all stuff that they did. This is just checking paper. 
National Gallery of Art. National Gallery of Art? Yeah. Took me a minute to absorb that. Of course. Of course. Of course. More signed pieces of artwork, 19. Oh, it's 2.2.2 at 475. I said all this artwork is about to make our money. And then we hit the coins. A little bit of jewelry. What is this? This is the heaviest piece so far. This might be worth some cash. It's, I mean, if it's, if it's by its weight, it's definitely worth the most. Mm -hmm. Wait till you look at that. That is cool. It's like kids fighting. I see one, oh. two, three, four different fights going on. It's weird. I see in the back. Well, there's a check, but they paid for it. Paid a hundred dollars for it. Nineteen sixty-five. Wow, that was a hundred dollars in nineteen sixty-five. Get thousand, out. Five thousand. Twenty thousand dollars. Oh my. We gotta find that artist's name. Let's see a watercolor. Clean frame, paint, reframe by. Oh, it's just the frame. So this is the only one that doesn't look like it was open. Jen, close. Sometimes you put jewelry in the corner. Yep. So first thing I did is look at the bottom. Oh, what is that? See, there's stuff on the bottom. Oh my gosh. I wasn't expecting to find that. The little horse show? I see. A little fuzzy needs a vacuum. Yeah. I clean right up though. What do you think that that's worth? I think that's another 50. 30? There's clothes everywhere in here. What's it worth? I don't know. Oh, there's all kinds of stuff down there. Hold on. Ruby girls. That's a groovy girl. And her clothes. Groovy. That's pretty groovy. I love the word groovy. It's groovy. I use it a lot. It's groovy. I tried starting a trend to get it to come back. Keep going, buddy. Oh. Yeah, we just use. You got us wanting to come in. Just use. What's going on in that box? Lots of fun. We got a couple boxes left. Yeah. It's definitely been chock full of surprises. Getting down to the nitty gritty. Old paperwork. Ephemera. Or just Jeff? Yep. A formula for world peace. Huh. Is that how you say it? Ephemera. 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 More old, of it. Just old, old paper. More old papers. I'm going to say that instead. Magazine. Where's the comic book stuff? I don't think there's comic books. I think this is... General Tire and Rubber Company. Broadway Express, Inc. President. I want to know what the artist, whoever did the artwork, relationship is to whoever had the money. Well, let's were they I think they both had the money or were they No, these are the people that had the money. So that that was her hobby. That was the lawyer's well, hobby, you say? I think she was a lawyer and I think he was an executive for a company. Just remember, keep your kids off drugs. Dare. Oh, we got stuff underneath there. We'll see if there's anything in the desk. Empty. It's definitely empty. We got a box. Wow, cabinet. It's better than Ooh. it. The letter people? You know about the letter people, just Jeff? Yeah, I think they're big into the alphabet. Alice for lollipop? Man, I remember we did the letter people. And we had L for lollipop, and we made lemon lollipops that day in kindergarten. You remember that? Yeah, dude. I remember everything. I remember where you had lunch for lunch eight weeks ago. Wendy's. Shh. 
We're not allowed to talk about that. All right, our last box. So this unit's had, I mean, we gotta get all this artwork checked out. We got Disney pieces, we know are worth money. Gold, silver coins, ephemera, just Jeff, and this box. <laughs> VHS tapes. So who knows what's on these tapes. But I love what I do. Hopefully you guys enjoy watching what I do. If you do, subscribe, like, share with all your friends, hit that thumbs up, help out the channel. We appreciate every single one of you. Anything you want to say, just Jeff? Hey, wait to see the video of the unit that I bought. Oh my gosh. Just wait. <laughs>